Hi everyone and welcome to My Story Short. Today we're joined by Morgan Steedman. How are you, Morgan? Yeah, I'm good, thank you. Great stuff. And uh, so we're going to talk about a bit of a weekend that, that you had, getting your, getting yourself a hat-trick against Gart Cairn at the weekend. Yeah, it was uh, good to get the season off to a positive start. The first two games, we never got the result that we wanted as a team, so it was good to get three points on the board and hopefully build on that build on our confidence and show that we we can if we work as a team and fight together we can get that win and we played some absolutely brilliant football so I think it's just taking that and using it for going forward and hopefully getting us higher up the table as quickly as possible. So it must have been a, a relief to get some points on the board at the weekend um, get you off the mark a bit, of a, a bit of a shaky start at the beginning of the season but you personally, obviously, getting your goals, you're, you're the number nine, they're looking for you to lead from the front. But then also, as a as a sign, as a marker to set down, it was against Gart Cairn. They were 90 minutes away from being an SWPL1 team last season. Um, and then going out and getting such a convincing win against them must be reassuring for you, a sign of intent for the club as a whole. Yeah, I think... Obviously, over the summer, a lot of movement happened between clubs. There was a lot of players that took the jump and went up to the the Prem One. So I think I think Gart Cairn especially uh, lost a few players, but still, as a team that were up there in second place, it kind of shows that the football that we can play, if we can play as well as we did on Sunday, and and hopefully not have as many um, shaky points during the game, and we can stay consistent with that, we could get three points from anyone on the day. Um, I think a lot of pressure was put on us at the start of the season, rightly so, from um, a number of different people about expectations of finishing higher up in the league and potentially that maybe affected some performances in the first couple of games of the season. So now, hopefully, we've got the three points on the board. We can kind of just build on that and take that confidence going forward into the next games. Excellent. So... We've we've spoken about it, but it must have been a good feeling for you to to get the the goals under your belt. Uh, looking ahead for the season, and obviously that's that's going to help the team as well. So, what are your personal aims for this season, and then the the team as a whole? What is the ambition? Is it to push for those promotion places? Definitely, I think as a team we have to be fighting for getting promoted. Um, why would you be playing if, if you didn't want to be finishing as high as possible and competing at that level? Um, me, personally, I've always been the same kind of player. It doesn't matter if I score, it's just as long as the team win and I can help contribute to that. That's all that I care about. Probably the opposite of what every other striker would tell you, but I'm not the kind of with a spreadsheet and tallying it all up. I just want the team to win and do well and, and get the three points. So, um, yeah, it's, it's just all about trying to compete and finish as high as we possibly can as a collective. And I think we've shown that we're capable of doing that. We just need to make sure that we can be as consistent as possible with the mentality and the, the performances to go with it. Now, obviously off the back of a win, you've got that first win under your belt. Has that changed the approach for this coming weekend? Or is it um, are you still got the, the same mentality? It was maybe just not clicking in the first couple of games and you're still going to go, there's a process there. Uh, or is it is it maybe changed? Is there something you've done different in that game to get that win? Well, we've kind of always focused on ourselves, but we'll have game plans uh, that we want to execute against certain teams that play certain ways. Um, but primarily we do focus on ourselves. And yeah, like you said, it just wasn't clicking in the first couple of games. I think... Looking at it, it was probably more a, a mentality thing. Um, obviously, there was slight tweaks and tactical changes, credit to the managers, as they obviously paid off. But um, I think, yeah, it's just about mentally going into the game, being confident in our own abilities and that when we play the way that we we know that we're all capable of playing, we, like I say, we can take the three points off anybody in our league and we just need to be be confident with, with ourselves in doing that. Well, that's excellent, Morgan, and thanks so much for joining us today. Thank you. And thank you, everyone, for joining us on SWPL My Story Short.